damn me in the face. Oh, really? To that place I didn't see before. Oh no! Ah, of course. Oh. I really like this moving the block mechanic thing. Um, where am I going? Oh, I, I see. I had to double back on myself. I was kind of like, what am I doing wrong here? A key! Ah. Oh, it's whispering now. That's unsettling. I guess I have to use the keys to unlock the the way down there. As well, I'm pretty convinced the strawberries unlock something. So I gotta care about the strawberries in my head. <coughs> squash, squash me. See, I need him to open that up. You know what these you know these things flying around remind me of? Those uh things from Super Meat Boy. As you died in those. That makes sense. Fuck, why am I dying so much here? Oh my god, this is not that hard. I just keep fucking it up. Doing? What am I fucking doing? Oh, oh my god, what are you doing, dude? You had it. This is what I passed by a minute ago. 
Okay, now we're good. Oh! Ah! No! Good stuff. We learnt before that they can trigger those, so we we know we can use that to our advantage. Right, without trying not to jump on his head, but I keep accidentally doing it. Stop it! Ugh. Oh! Getting crushed. That is definitely, that's definitely the goal here, is to get to there. Whoa. Oh, we got ourselves another door to go through. Oh, shit. I wish it wasn't so dark. <laughs> I like being able to see all my options when I'm platforming. Frustrating to stop playing Super Meat Boy ones. Oh, I love Super Meat Boy. That's such a good game. Super Meat Boy is like, it's definitely up there as one of the best platforms. Platforms as of all time. Just just because of how good the mechanics in that game are. It's just so good. Supposed to get into that. Ah. Oh. Well, it still doesn't help me get into that. Oh, no, there it is. There you go. Ah, okay. 
Gotta guide this guy up here. Alright, so that's a platformer. It's a platform, I should say. Okay, and then what we're we looking at. Ah, right. Oh, we don't want, we want to save a boost there. Right, I get it. What is that even a key for? Ah. If I went up here or not. Oh, maybe I don't want to go this way. Ooh, I'm starting to think that that glowing path is not the way right is this like an optional way here i'm really confused like the up seems like now the proper way to go and this seems like a optional way to go yeah, it looks like it is I just have no, I have no idea where I am now in terms of like the right path, the the optional path. Again, the game's the game that game's the game's habit of using the lights to mean both a secret and a way forward is uh, confusing. Ah, I'm hoping this leads me to like a blue heart. it will. I haven't seen a sign of a blue heart yet. That does go the right way. Oh, okay. Theo, I finally found you. I knew you'd make it. It wasn't easy. Are oh, these monsters really coming from inside me? up. that's a valid question. I'll be happy to discuss how the monsters relate to your inner self, but right now my inner self is real sick of being stuck in this crystal. Oh, right. Uh, don't worry, I'll break you out. Well, this is a solid start, but uh, Crystal is like an expression of my negative psychic energy. Or whatever. Yeah, but how do we break it? If I knew I trapped myself in this thing, maybe I could bust out. But I don't. And I don't think I can get to the bottom of it while we're stuck in this nightmare dimension. I hate to say it, but you might have to... Theo, don't even think about that. I'm not leaving you. I'm not leaving you behind. It's like, oh, hell no, you better not leave me in this place. Yeah, he's like, oh, I was going to say, carry me. 
I was gonna say you might have to carry me. Oh, yeah, I can do that. Oh, interesting. Dang, girl, you can lift. All right. A whole new mechanic now. All right, you got this. Crushing it. That door didn't stand a chance. I oh, hope you know how to deal with these things. How about I throw you at it? Oh. Hashtag crushing it. Oh, another one? Come on. Yeah, my my inner self doesn't like me very much, apparently. Damn it. in the world. to bounce off them. Whoa! What the hell just happened then? I didn't realize that blast knocked me so far. Oh man. I may have just worked out a puzzle or two. I missed. No! Are you fucking kidding me right now? I hate that. God. Damn it. He, the blast threw me out of the room. Are you kidding me? Fuck's sake. I couldn't get back in either. It wouldn't let me go back in. I've missed multiple strawberries to be fair, but that's just annoying. That's so annoying. That's so annoying. Hide me out of the goddamn room. Look, you can't go back in once you're out.
What the jump? I, I don't understand. Oh my god, fuck off, dude. What am I trying to do here? I have no idea. I can't even get the chance to work it out because these fuckers are a nightmare to avoid. Oh, what? I just had to go over there? Oh. Of course. Oh, I do not like those monsters. They are a big old pain in the ass. I actually was trying to put him down there. Yeah. Of course, yeah, that makes sense. Ah, uh, Fia, I'm sorry. Throw and then boost. Smart. Didn't think about that. Just to be close, I can feel it. Oh, please be close. I don't want to deal with this anymore. This has officially been my least favorite part so far. I haven't carried this guy around. Oh good. Fucked up the throw. Where's some trampoline clouds? Yes, because that was optional. And I chose to do that. Oh 
great. Yeah, this this would be fun on B side. Holy moly. Please stop attacking me. You are a fucking annoying as shit. Oh god. Ugh. 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 Thinking I in my face. I missed a couple there. I never saw, oh shit. I never saw the blue heart at all during that. Which is weird. Well, this make me hate myself. It should be horrendous. Oh my gosh. I didn't know he had the cell phone in his hand. That's really good. That's really good. Sacks. Good stuff. Timing on some of these is so like spot on. Oh, wrong direction. God damn, the music in here is fleek. <laughs> it's on fleek. Uh... I get the soundtrack for this. I haven't bought it yet, but I was looking at it earlier on Bandcamp. I'm gonna grab it. Definitely grabbing the B sides. I think the B side's probably my favorite. got very Donkey Kong vibes. Yeah, I think the reason the B-sides feel so long is because of just how much you're dying on them. Oh, was that the first screen done? <laughs> Only took a couple of deaths. 
Oh, fuck me. What the hell? Any the game that's made you actually frustrated yet? When you're here for the clouds? has got a similar mechanic to it as well. Oh yeah, this is gonna get my nose. to find myself off. How you do these? I don't understand the timing on that. I don't get that. This one I understand. This one I do not get. There we go. Don't think I understood how I did that though, which is not great because I know that's going to pop up a lot. Gosh, all right, I see. Right, I think I, oh my days. Oh my days. Well, at least I see what I'm doing here. Seeing the way to solve it is 50% of the way to solving it. The other half is actually solving it. <laughs> okay. timing on that. Can we get a daze counter? No. It'll make me way too self-conscious. Let's not do it. <laughs> we won't do it. I'm just saying I'm fair, but to be fair most of the time now. So there's that door I couldn't open before, so that's something. What the fuck is that? Why did that? All right, all right. Well, fuck it, whatever. Navigating this place is gonna be fun.
Oh my days, oh my days, oh my days, oh my days, oh oh my days, oh my days. Ah. Okay. Oh my days. When I started saying oh my days, uh, I've always said it forever. You just you weren't paying enough attention. That's that, that's the real truth. You just never pay enough attention to me. It's why we it's why we never worked out. I do love this music though. I like the way I was doing it before. This is good. Seems like the right way. The song's group doesn't fit the level. None of the music's fit. None, none of the B-side tracks have really fit the level. They're just good songs. <laughs> you know? Silly of me. So this is a B side. Yeah, that's just why it's so hard. is going but we're taking the ride and we ride that back. Very cool. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh, yeah. She was she, she was worried about the driveway in the beginning. Look what she's doing now. Doing it too late. Oh, it's 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 quite hard to like get to to move the control stick around in the right direction that fast. You're like, uh, 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 uh. If 
Oak. I've been using the um, I've been using a joystick for this. Usually I use D-pads when I play control when I play um, platformers, but for some reason the joysticks felt better with this one. Oh boy, oh boy, I see. Interesting. That's going to be a very interesting jump to make. Yeah, mm, I'm not sure how I timed that. I, yeah, I mean, I guess you, you could totally do this on D-pad. I just haven't. I think it might even be easier to play on D-pad. I don't like the D-pad on the Xbox One, though. I think it's awful. If I was, on PS, if I was playing some PS4, I'd probably play it with D-pad. Shit. Because I think you have more control, then. I've always said this, the Xbox has way nicer triggers, and the, and the, PS, the, the Xbox controllers have way nicer triggers, but terrible D-pads, and the PS4s have really good D-pads, but fucking awful triggers. If I could just sort of mush the two together. The triggers, the triggers on the fucking PS4 are horrendous. Like, they are so sensitive. I'm like, put the control down. <laughs> I, if, I'm, if, I'm, if it's a game where the triggers are important, fuck, they've gone off and you're fucked at that point. It's the amount of times those PS4 triggers, oh God. I don't know what they were thinking when they made those. It's weird because the PS4, PS3 controller is like one of my all-time favorite controllers. Uh, the, P, the the Switch one, um, I still I the, the Switch D-pad I think is just about as good as the Xbox one. Honestly, I don't like it. I like I like the fact that like these are separated on the PS4 makes it a lot easier to use. Like on the Pro, it's all like one. This it's a tiny fucking thing. I like I do like the. The triggers don't feel as, like, good on the, like, they just feel really good to press on the Xbox. 
uh, the Xbox One controller. They're okay on this, though. They work well. They just don't feel as good to press. Everything else about this is fine. I just... The PS... The, the, the DualShock controllers are the only D-pads I really like. Oh, and the Super Nintendo one. I like the Super Nintendo one. Oh, shit. Let's get a big old face of me. Every Mad Cat's control I've ever had in my life was like this sort of GameCube one. And they always, they always broke and were always terrible. So I've always had this thing against Mad Cat stuff ever since then. They made really bad GameCube controllers. Cheap, cheap third party controls are typically pretty garbage. But yes, that 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 that's given me like a dislike for Mad Cats. That's uh, the GameCube controller they used to make. Even though I know they make good like fighting sticks and shit like that. In the days when you you would have one good control and three bad ones yes and then you'd always make sure your friends use the bad ones and they'd be like you're only winning because you got the good control and you're like no shut up no i'm not it's because you suck fight for whoever gets the win winner gets to use the good controller that's so that's how you sell it is one room. Oh. Kind of sad, actually. I burst one of my DS4, my um, DualShock 4s. I spilled water on it. I had, a, I had, I had my my big old Gazel Gallon on the bed, but I hadn't. I forgotten to actually properly scroll on the lid. And I stood on my bed, and it made the Gazel Gallon move, and um, it spilled water all over the controller, and it won't charge. The light doesn't work on it anymore, and it won't charge. I was like, I don't know if it's ever gonna work. I could, I, it, it would say it was charging, but they would, it wouldn't, it won't hold any charge, and like the light doesn't work. So I was like, yeah, I think this thing is broken. It's annoying. They're not the cheapest things in the world. Fuck. God damn this room. What is this, man? This is ridiculous. Actually, I think the we Switch Pro controllers are the most expensive, right? Oh, 
Of all the controllers I've ever owned, my favorites are the DualShock 4. Even despite shitty triggers. DualShock 4. DualShock 3. Maybe. Maybe the Wii U Pro Controller. That's probably my favorite ones. Even though the ones I use the most are most definitely the Xbox ones. Because they just work really easily with everything on computer. <laughs> Tablet. Oh yeah, it's definitely one of my favorite fucking pieces of garbage ever that is. Number one piece of garbage. Fuck, I can't manage to do that. Oh yeah, no, I know this stuff to emulate the DS4 really easily. I also, I, I tell you what I do find, the DS4, DualShock 4, uh, micro USB connection, I find it like disconnects really easily if I move it around too much. N64, I'm sorry, nobody actually likes the N64 controller. When was the last time you used that thing? It's terrible. There's a, a horrendous controller. The Trident. As if, if far as uniqueness goes, yeah. It's not a good controller. Though. I put that... Some of like, the worst controllers I've ever used, like, thinking back in my time, 64 definitely, because the joystick on that thing really, really destroyed my hand. The original Xbox controller is a fucking chunky, horrible nightmare. I never used a Dreamcast, but I was never sure about that one. I don't believe for a second you think the 64 controller is a good one. I believe that it's a troll. I can't imagine, I just can't, I can't, I can't, I can't deal with that. I can't deal with the idea that a 64 controller would be someone's favorite. It blows my mind. It looks cool. I mean, it looks like something, and then you, you look at it, you're like, that's kind of cool. And then you're like, oh, it's a controller? Shit. You used that? Yeah, I did. Wow. It's crazy, man. I know. Ah, oh, okay, I see. I get it. I'm getting it now. Gaming controller is okay, although I've been using it a lot playing Smash with my friends. I gotta say, the um, triggers on the GameCube controller are really weird. I find the I find the, the the triggers on the GameCube to be quite um, annoying to press at times. Like they, they they I have to press them like stupid hard. But I do like the GameCube controller. Poop! That was a dumb idea. Shouldn't have done that. But I do like them. I I use a game controller for years. Because ah. <clears throat> when I had the GameCube and shit, I didn't get I didn't get I didn't like I, I I was very much like a Nintendo child for a long time in my life because I never had a PS4. I grew up with Super Nintendo. And I had um, 64 and a GameCube. I got like a PS1 like quite late into its cycle, and then a PS2, like, I 
feel like I, I feel like I got a PS2 like after its cycle came out. I think I got a PS3 because it was a game. Because I remember that. No, I remember what happened. No, I didn't get. No, I didn't get a PS2. No, I did. No, I did get. I did get a PS2 because I played Metal Gear. No, I got a PS1 and I played Metal Gear. And I, then I was like, holy shit, Metal Gear games are on these consoles. I have to buy these from now on. So I bought a PS2 to play Metal Gear Solid 2. I bought a PS3 to play Metal Gear Solid 4. So that used to be what would that would that used to be what would sell me a console is if Metal Gear was on it. I'm glad I didn't buy a PS4 for Metal Gear Solid 5 though. Did not like that game. God damn, you gotta be real precise with those uh, little tentacles. Jesus. Uh. GameCube bongos. <laughs> Never used the uh, power glove. My perfect controller I have. <laughs> it would be the it would be the it would be the Wii controller. Oh, that's one of the worst controllers. This is the Wii. It'd be the Wii mote, uh, but um, three of them in the shape of a 64 thing, and you wiggle them about in like a tri trident kind of Wii mote nightmare. And then also every now and then it shoots jizz out the back of it at you, just to remind you what you're using. I don't know why jizz. Maybe maybe anything else. Maybe like shoots mayonnaise at you. Or something it's something that looks like jizz. Mayonnaise doesn't look like jizz. Uh, I don't know where I'm, I don't know where I'm going with this one. How do I, fuck, I can hit that thing, but where the fuck do I go after that? No buttons. Oh my god, that'd be so weird to have a controller with no buttons on it. <laughs> you got yeah, and the controller doesn't work unless it's full of mayonnaise. So like it won't, you can't just em you can't just remove the mayonnaise. Like it fu it power it's powered by mayonnaise. So like the mayonnaise is an important part of the controller's function. Like most games are made of the idea that you know mayonnaise will shoot out in your face when you uh, die or something like that. <laughs> well, that sounds like a real horrible controller. It's like it's a it's a controller that shoots mayonnaise, but it solved the energy. It's it solved the power crisis, the energy crisis of the 20, uh, 2050, 2050th century, 20, 50, 21st, 20, 21st century. <laughs> Best one ever for fighting games was the Sega Saturn controller. Never used that. No wireless, the controllers are wide and the cables are foot long. Yes. <laughs> oh, it's, you know what? I, I've remembered what one of my favorite controllers of all time was. The Wave Bird. I don't, I used to, oh, fuck me. I used to use that controller all the time. I didn't, I remember when I, I never knew about the whole like, kind of delay thing with the wireless there. Oh, Jesus. I used to use the Wave Bird all the time. That thing is, is a is a chunky GameCube controller, but I used to fucking love that controller for some reason. I 
Like, I'm not sure if it was actually good or if I'm just, if it's just nostalgia think, making me think it was good, but I used to love that thing. It had, like, it had such a long, like, the, it, the, the battery life of it was so long. It's like the, like, the Wii U Pro Controller. I think I've charged that, I swear I've only charged that controller about four times in my life. That might be because I wasn't using it much, because it was on the Wii U, which, you know... Yeah, it was the Wii U, but... Um, God, yeah, I, I don't remember, like, ever charging that controller. Oh, yeah, no, I think, I think, uh, I'm pretty sure the last time I checked my wave bird, it's still... Like, the batteries that were in it, which have been in there for a very long time, still run. Battery life on the joy switch con Um, I wouldn't know. I never, ever use the Joy-Cons. <laughs> Unless the game is going to force me to use the Joy-Cons, I, I won't do it. As much as I love, like, Nintendo innovating controllers, like, I do not give a shit about it. It has to be said. It's like, I, I don't really want innovation in my controllers, I just want to use a normal controller. Fuck, it took me ages to... God damn, I could not get that guy. I could not manage to hit that switch. Platform with a, with, a, with a flight stick? That sounds really not fun. Oh! You, mm, the boost of the thing hit me up and then I lost control and went into the spikes. God damn it. Sweet mates had a wave bird when my roommate made everyone in our sweet place smash birds with him. Every time I used the wave bird, it felt wrong, even though I couldn't tell why. Yeah, it's fair enough. I had Nintendo force you to buy stupid expensive controllers if you want to play the games normally. Oh, this fucking controller is way over expensive. The Switch Pro controller is like stupid expensive. Oh, it's terrible. For me, I can't. Like, I, I would not be able to play games on the Switch with the Joy-Cons. They just feel horrible to me. 
If I didn't have the pro controller, I would probably have just been like, meh, goodbye Switch. Give me like actual controls. Like I, I, I was, I got pretty close to that with the fucking Wii. With half the games I had to play with the goddamn fucking Joy-Con, the stupid shit. You can get cheaper pro controllers, but they don't have HD rumble, <laughs> which you know is important. I, I, brought, I think I brought my brought my brother like one or two. Well, actually, they're Nintendo brand ones. To be fair, they're like wired pro controllers. They just they don't have. I think they don't have the gyro in them. No, maybe they do have HD rumble. I don't know. They don't have the gyro in them. The wired pro controllers. Which isn't necessarily a bad thing, to be fair. It would make playing Breath of the Wild in those in those shrines pretty difficult. This is a really annoying piece to do. Yay! Right, I have to use him to bounce over there, I get it. Oh shit. Oh boy, oh no. It's the Temple Remix featuring your boy, Mixmaster Fio! Well, at least I hope I'm getting close to the end. may take literally for ah oh, fuck me this may Theo this may take literally forever but it's morning somewhere Noon somewhere in the world right now. Shit, Fio! That's the only way I can see to do what I just did. <laughs> use the use the boost to get me over. Cannon, is it? <laughs> Yo, too, too meta. Stop it. Oh. 
that the wrong way. That is wild, man. Some of these levels are just bonkers. Mm, okay, I gotta throw it and then catch it, I think. This should be good. This should be good. Oh, my God. Oh, I just wanted it off myself there. throw it again. Man, this is very Donkey Kong-esque, this music. I think on my sub renewal, I will now send my new name. Rest in peace. Place in chat leaderboards. Chat leaderboards. Oh God, right. See, see, see what I mean. What will your? You, you, is this gonna be like a? Is this gonna be like an annual thing for you? The changing of the name. It's time for the great changing of the name. Can you be Papa Nips? <laughs> Papa Nips is a great name. Right. I'm not sure if I'm doing that wrong or if I'm just fucking up on the execution. No, it is possible I'm just fucking up on the execution. I did it, and then I fucking died anyway. Can you wall jump with him in your hands? Have I just never noticed this before? If you can wall jump with him in your hands, then I'm a fucking idiot.
because I'm making this way more difficult than it needs to be if you can wall jump with him in your hands. <laughs> shit you can. I'm an actual idiot. Okay, I have to jump and then throw him. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I didn't realize that. How, why did I never try and do that? I love when I do that. I'm just like, I just assume that a mechanic is not gonna work. Like, oh, that's not gonna work, obviously. Hashtag Mayo Power. Hashtag the face of Twitch. Let's have a look at these steam elements, stream elements, chat stats. I wonder where there is in the chat where Kappa isn't, one, isn't near the top of the most used Twitch emotes in the channel. Hashtag, hashtag B, man. Hashtag B is the most used hashtags. Hashtag B, hashtag C, hashtag A, hashtag three, two, one, four, and then, and those all have like a hundred at least. And then the most used one after that is hashtag Mayo Power. Hashtag blessed. Hashtag shred that stuff button. Right. Where was I? Right, we're getting this now. I don't know why. I, I, I don't know why I'm finding this bit hard now. Papa Nips, Mama Dips. Uh, this one is clearly impossible. Good stuff, good stuff. Him being on that triggers the fall. Are you kidding me? What the fuck am I? What? <laughs> that is that is horrendous. I have to take you with me now. Literal master of Twitch. Thank you. 
Oh, wow. Way to take it away from me, Aras. Jeez. That last bit then. Doing like wild maneuvers whilst throwing that guy, boosting, grabbing him, throwing him again, landing down, boosting, grabbing him, throwing him again. Oh. Literal, literal platforming god right here. Oh, done it. We've done it. The man's done it. Right, let's grab the leftover strawberries there's one strawberry back there is there and then the blue hearts so there's a strawberry like right at the start maybe not right at the start but there's one before the one that I got I know I know I know there's a I know where some things are I know there was one strawberry I remember missing because the game pushed me through the doorway before I was ready that was oh that would be that last one um there's still I'm not so sure about 100 percent in it I'm getting all the strawberries I'd like to get all the strawberries and hearts. And then that's my current goal. Right, so I have already I've already missed one then. You play any of the low bit mini games? I've found I've only know of one. Um of the, the one, the, the old, the old, uh, the one from the, in the, in the, the thingy place. Oh, shit. Oh, this might be it. Nailed it. That's a piece of shit, that one, yeah. Yeah, there's only one. Leosh! Thanks for the hunting yesterday, man. I didn't even see you pop in before. <laughs> Hashtag super smart, really handsome, everyone loves him. Right at the end of the level, which is really annoying. <laughs> I don't, uh, don't want to do it right now. <laughs> I don't want to do it right now. No, I do want to get the heart though. Which chapter is the heart in everyone? Which part? I think it's in. I want to say. Depths, maybe perhaps surge. 
There was like there was the there was that door, but I didn't have a key for it. Hashtag handsome smart streamer. Hashtag biggest dick on Twitch. Hashtag my name is Richard. My name isn't Richard, but that makes the hashtag biggest dick a funny thing, you see. I think it was in search, right? We'll double check on this one. Oh shit. Hashtag oh hi Mark. <laughs> like that. Hashtag my name is Richard. Hashtag my name isn't Richard. Oh no, hang on. I think this is past from where we needed to be. That might be my new favorite tweet. Hashtag my name is Richard. Hashtag my name isn't Richard. Uh, not unraveling. Maybe it was in depths actually. I feel like it was at the bottom of depths. No. Hmm. You know what? We'll come back for the strawberries. Don't want to deal with that right now. What time is it? I think I have enough time to do at least some of this chapter. Did you know it is impossible to outrun your own reflection? Did you know that, chat? Did you know? Theo, you're awake. Am I? I'm skeptical. I had a messed up nightmare. Yeah, about that. Wait. Oh, yep. Yeah. It's all coming back to me now. That's actually, that actually happened. Thanks for getting us out of there. I'm glad we were in it together. I don't know if I could have done that alone. How long was I out for? What's really... What? Oh. Am I picking his? Clearly this isn't a normal mountain. What's really going on here? I should have told you sooner. Back of the old ruins, a part of me escaped from a mirror. A part I'm not very proud of. I swear I dreamt it. You think the mountain made her real? Yeah. She's been haunting me the whole time. She lashed out at Mr. Oshiro. I think she was the reason the gondola stalled out. And she was there in the temple. Why didn't you say something? <laughs> I wouldn't have gone into that temple if I knew this mountain was capable of... I tried to stop you. You could have mentioned that your demon doppelganger was on the loose. Oh, come on, Theo. You know how crazy this sounds. I didn't even believe it myself. Okay, okay. I understand. Next time, just, you know, talk to me, though. I promise I'll believe you. We need to communicate more in our relationship. <laughs> Because I love you. Why is it so easy for you to trust me? Why is it so easy for you to trust me? 
Surely you barely, you, seriously, you barely know me. Honestly, you remind me of my sister. That's adorable. Oh, but I have the hots for my sister. Oh, that's gross. What's she like? Oh, you'd love her. She, actually, she you might not get along with Fizz, but you'd eventually love her. She's a literal rock star. She's a musician? That's so cool. Okay, she's not a literal rock star. Alex is just amazing in everything. She's studying to be a civil rights lawyer. Wow, how do I remind you of her? You both live so deep inside your own heads. Oh. Alex has this amazing internal compass. It's obvious that she'll get where she needs to be. I can see that in you too. I wish I could say the same for myself. Oh my god, there's so many options. This sounds great. Man. Who do you think built the temple? It looks like, it looks ancient. Yeah, I was hoping she was a little rock-shaped star as well. It must, it must predate everything else on the mountain. The resorts, the ruins, the city. There's a lot of history here. Yeah. This mountain has meant so many things to so many people. I'm starting to understand where that crazy old lady lives here. <laughs> you ran into her too? What's her deal? I think she's just a mean person. I mean, but she does seem pretty content living out here. So, how long was I out for? Must have been a few hours. Man, what a ride. Tell me about it. Are you okay? I mean, aside from the existential crisis? Yeah, I'm fine. Thank you, Theo. For believing in me back there, I mean... Believing in you was the easy part. I wish I could have helped. I was pretty useless stuck in that thing. You actually helped a lot. Honestly, I couldn't have made it without your support. Your sister sounds great. I really remind you of her? You kidding me? You're the one who said dead set on climbing the mountain. And you don't even know why. The classic Alex. <sighs> I'm just teasing you. Who are you climb? Why are you climbing the mountain anyway? Who are you climbing? You're right. I don't even know why. I just had to get out of my head. I'm stuck in a cycle. You're preaching to the choir here. I've had, a I've had many a soul-destroying day job. Work is fine, actually. I just... I'm going crazy. I can't stop thinking about dumb crap that doesn't matter. My brain fixated on these stupid things that happened forever ago. I should be over them. None of it even matters. I'm good at keeping up appearances, but the truth is I'm barely holding it together. I'm sorry, that's pretty rough stuff. Can I help? Already helping. Feels good to say it out loud. You don't talk about it. You don't talk to anyone about it? No, not really. My mum knows I get depressed and have panic attacks. That's about it. No wonder you feel trapped. How do you cope with anything? I, I drink, mostly. And get mad at people on the internet. <laughs> oh. It's too real. That expresses a lot of people on Twitter. So how about you? What brought you to the mountain? I'm kind of bumming around. I I like the fact that I kind of get the feeling from these religious friends. I kind of like that there's not really any romantic stuff between them. As usual. I started this new job in Seattle. I thought I finally knew what I was supposed to be doing in my life. But I hated it. So I quit after a week and hopped a bus to Canada. I just felt this urge to, you know, get lost in the middle of nowhere. Now that I'm saying that loud, I realize how flaky it sounds. It sounds like you're under a lot of pressure. Pressure. <laughs> Not really. Everyone is so patient with me, though I guess I am putting a lot of pressure on myself. People always think I'm comparing myself to Alex, but I swear that isn't the problem. I'm just worried I'll never figure out where I'm going. You said you wanted to feel lost. Maybe you should just embrace that for now. Maybe. Would you mind talking about what depression is like? Hmm. It sucks. <laughs> yeah, but like, what does it feel like? I like struggles with it too. I really want to understand. We can talk about something else if you want. It's like, I'm at the bottom of the ocean. 
And I can't see anything in any direction. Oh god, it's Subnautica. It's claustrophobic, yet I feel exposed. Oh god! It's claustro- it's, it's fucking Subnautica! I remember feeling normal. But now it feels just out of reach, no matter how what I try. Then again, I was probably always messed up. I just took something hurtful to bring it out. There must be something wrong with me. Subnautica is depression personified. Whatever happened, I'm sure it's not your fault. I guess I thought that I could... I don't know. I just start... I'm just floating in this abyss, swimming in a random direction. Hoping that I find something. It's really why I'm here. But I can't escape myself. I'm literally fighting myself the entire way. Maybe this is all pointless. Saxo, you just saved my life. That's not pointless. Yeah. Look, you're a good person. You're a little tense. You're a little intense, but you're a good person. I think you're just trying to push out of that rut you're stuck in. Depression does have a lot of sea dragons. And that's a totally legit reason to climb a mountain. <laughs> Maybe. I mean, that's helpful. This, uh, this part of you that's haunting you, maybe she comes with the territory. So you think I'm stuck with her forever? Well, I mean, she's stuck with you too. That's not helpful. So you want to destroy this part of you? Won't that hurt you too? If I don't, she's just going to keep bullying me. She says she's protecting me, but that's obviously not true. Maybe she thinks she is. I mean, she could be some kind of twisted defense mechanism. Honestly, who cares? She just has so much control over me. I hate it. Maybe you can learn to control her instead. Well, the feather helps a lot. Thanks for teaching me that. Just one of my grandpa's many nuggets of wisdom. Uh, are you close to your grandpa? Yeah, I was. Oh, I'm sorry. That's okay. That's just how it is. All I can do is stay positive. And, I, you know, live a meaningful life. Because that's what he would want. I'm so sorry for you. Thanks. What else did you learn from your grandpa? Let's keep going about the grandpa. <laughs> so much stuff. Actually, he was the one who told me about Celeste Mountain. He always said that his place changed his life. <laughs> After I quit my job in Seattle, I realized how close I was to it. I felt like he was telling me to come here. Grandpa said that the mountain was special. Do you think he went through the temple like us? Do you think he understood the power of the mountain? He never talked about what happened here. I thought your grandpa was as messed up as me. His experience was probably less violent. He found the mountain before I was born. I don't know what he was like before that. I wonder what he learned about himself here. Why not take a vacation instead? What do you mean? Dude, you need a change so you can, so you chose to climb a mountain. Why not do something relaxing instead? Go to Hawaii or, you know, like, take a bath? I guess I feel like I need to accomplish something? Sounds like you have enough on your plate already. I guess it's, it's kind of extreme. But that's how I am. I need something to challenge me. And I can't just do something a little bit. It's all of me or nothing. You know what? I want to remember this night. Let's take a selfie. Oh my god, let's take a selfie. I thought you'd never ask. Hashtag millennials. <laughs> You know, despite everything, I feel pretty good right now. Wait a second. You're gonna reach the summit tomorrow? Don't jinx it. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm ready to put this all behind me. Well, I'm cheering you on. We should get some sleep. Okay, good night, Theo. Thanks for, you know, being cool. What can I say? It comes naturally. He's a little cuties.
interesting. Whoa! What the hell? Whoa. The Northern Lights is so beautiful. Yeah, they are. Where are we? We need to talk. Okay. I finally understand who you are. You're not my true reflection. I'm not? You're everything I need to leave behind. You're cruel, paranoid, controlling. Why would you say that? No, it's okay. I understand now. I don't need you anymore. So you're just abandoning me? I'm setting you free. We'll both be so much happier. You're so... So... So stupid! Oh god. You think you can just leave me behind? You think you can blame everything on me? You think you're above me? Answer me! Oh, Jesus. Calm down, please! Calm down! Breathe, Zax up. Use the feather. She's crawling out of the frame. It's terrifying. And everybody, it's time to use the power of the breathing feather. Uh-oh, uh-oh, I can't control the feather anymore. You're gonna think about a feather to stop me? Oh, you are not above me. And you couldn't climb this mountain. It's time to accept that. Saxa, what's happening? 